He's doing it. He's delivering a show, and he's right here on your screen. It's gonna be Raflo versus Kid. It's gonna be me, Brawler, versus Paul Lutena. Very interesting, and you said, oh, wow, well, stay away, immediate drop on. 16% on get the Thurper, me. too. Nice punish, the Rising there doesn't get much more out of it, but the damage is wrecking. Okay, gonna see where he goes next for Flo. It's such a menace off, on, on the ledge, man. So yeah. hard to get past him. Finds a single hit of the Thurper, is gonna get him some room to get off the ledge. And look at the neutral, look at the way Kid is relying on his empty movements. Mm -hmm. And then the patience with the shield too, just not committing into Politana because that's where he loses, right? So plays it very slow. The parries are coming out too. Has the composure to go for parries even on the top eight stage. Mm -hmm. So far, Kid is looking solid, but this game is all but even. Has that suplex out, you gotta watch out for the command grab. There's about 20%, doesn't kill, does a lot of damage, you yep. gotta watch out. Can't be staying in shield too often. Kid will, you know, you know, call you out. Call you out, the single up B, or sorry, a single up air, not gonna land in 2D up B, the suplex from ledge, big damage, solid 20% right there. And Ooh. tries to go for the flashing Mac punch, that is a huge KO move. Yep. Not quite gonna do it, the flip kick too. Or, well, the faint jump. Uh, <laughs> let's be fair, I just flip kick. <laughs> Kid, staying alive. Oh yeah, looking for that neutral beat, kind of understanding. For Flo's oh. too near him, you might just die again. Can't find mm -hmm. the flashing Mac punch. Cannot find that final hit. The Flo avoiding it beautifully. But the Flo not finding the final hit either. That jab that. is going to prove me wrong. The Flo taking first blood in the set. I like that. The flashing back punch on the on the LB cancel. Mm -hmm. But the Flo, he's he's really, in my opinion, the best politician at mixing up the LB cancels. Sure. And we saw right there just ma making a fool out of Kid with the uh, direction of the LB. Okay, you see Kid, like you said before, a lot of the time using that empty top movement to kind of understand that fast fall and mobility to kind of keep Raflo guessing where he wants to be. Unfortunately, though, you just can't break down this fortress that Raflo is right now. Gonna be juggling, and that's where he there wants it to is. be, and so does Kid with that proper. Only now it's only looks percent, but percent doesn't really matter to a character like me, Brawler, bro. You make one mistake on that platform, these by plats especially, your stock's gone in a flash. Oh yeah, this is the rage. This is all rage for Kid. He's looking for a hit. Look at the patience from Raflo. I like that. Kid. Looking for a solid hit, not finding it. Raflo instead goes for a jump read, does not find it. Kid loves that. Gets the reset neutral, gets to find something of his own, but they're just both avoiding the advantage state reward mm -hmm. of the other character. <laughs> and Kid looking for the up tilt, not finding it. The washing machine coming through. And Raflo finishing it off with a solid back air. Yeah, hanging them to dry as well, man. You know, Kid has no answer right now. Geff definitely doing the chores at the moment. Uh, and Raflo doing a good job keeping away with the explosive flame right now. The up air as well. And the net to negate any aerial approach from Kid. Big dash attack gonna push him off stage, but Kid can't find a big substantial answer yeah. right now. There's the parry again. I think that's gonna be his ticket to win it. Mm -hmm. But can you find more? Kid with the jump read. No double jump for Paulu. That should be curtains. And that is curtains. What an explosive continuation from Kid. Great recognition on the double jump right there. Doesn't need the ladders. We can go to the sides as well, says Kid. We can go all around the world as a matter. Either oh, way. Oh, yeah. I got my ticket. Either way, just can't get back on stage. Those nares are really working Ruffalo's favor. Rolls away from the platform. Tech chasing. Doesn't want to get hit by the uh -oh. up. And now it's Kid's time. Wants that nair dragged down into the ground. Can't find it. Uh, and going for the thropper immediately. Kid with the up airs, he's finding the stray hits, but the up airs are not quite converting yet. We're a few percentage off, but now you gotta be worried when you're a flow because you can see Kid, he's looking for the dash tax, he's looking for the up airs. He's covering the up beast to center, but Raflo's not giving it. Down throw, no confirm, no air dodge either. Look at the disadvantage from Raflo, so composed here. So patient as well, understanding where he mm -hmm. wants to be, where Kid wants to be. Again, the threat bubble, Raflo understanding where he needs to be in, in oh, order to oh, not get hit until oh, now. Oh. Big back air, where's Raflo gonna go? Teleport. Whoa! Oh, tries to get the neutral beat on that on that uh, recovery. Just can't find it though. The neutral beat to two frame. That's genius. Did not work out throw for, from Kid. He's still in the game. He's still in the driver's seat. You can see Raflo just playing around the pressure that Kid is establishing. Finally, finding some pressure of his own. I like the feint jump off stage. I like what? the flashing that puts the grab whiffed. Fabs, we're looking at. A crescendo of pressure here. They're both looking for their hits and none of them are sticking. Big commitment with the up smash Wait. from Kid, but still staying alive. Push him away with the forward that wants to get again. Kid, don't corner yourself. You cannot be doing that against a player like Aflo. The air dodge comes out, pulls the trigger, the fourth throw. That's almost a kill throw here. How's he get back to stage? Wants to get back as well. No! What? And so many whiffs, spaghetti moments in that situation, but still Aflo clears up the plate. The chores keep going, Raflo taking that first game.
Uh, but that could have been scary. That could have been Kid's game to lose, honestly. Are you kidding me? And the willingness of Kid to pull the trigger scared him so far. And at the end, it was his biggest enemy. The up B, a little bit off on the recognition, left, right, right? It was essentially an unreactable mix-up. And Kid, what I like is he had the faith. He wanted to pull, he was willing to pull the trigger even when it was ambiguous. Mm -hmm. And so he had full faith in his own recognition of the situation, but was a little bit off. Let's see if that infects his mental or if he's gonna stay consistent here with his call-out heavy gameplay. The flow so far, again, getting that early lead with those Palu combos. Uh, as expected. Of course, yeah. I mean, that's kind of the early damage the pilot attacks, I like to call it. You just have to accept it. But you don't have to accept those back airs right now, but Reflo doing a good uh -oh. job. Oh, re -grab. stage. But oh, wow, okay. just going all the way there around, kid. Uh, managing to survive. Scary situation for Reflo, though. Uh, Reflo's consistently pressuring this up e to the platform. Um, well, Kid pressuring the up to the platform consistently, but Raflo just mixing up the timing, and Kid not entirely ready. Is looking for these up airs, looking for some sort of hit to stick, but Raflo, look at how nimble he is, just retreating the nair. Mm -hmm. Down tilt as a mix up, too. Another down tilt. The air dodge gets red. No reward, though. Raflo right now looking. Oh, oh that's my a combo. God. That's a combo. Picked him up off the ledge and smacked him away. Big fish showing Kid taking the lead. The one-inch punch, enough to do the deed. Kid barely makes it back. The four tilt comes through, but it's not enough. And that air dodge, just a little bit awkward because of the properties. Air dodge is right into the explosive flame. Not what you want to see when you're a kid, but that flow, great way to even it up. Lingering dash tag gonna catch him out again. Uh -oh. Can't find it right there. The forward air, pushing him away. Poking tool, good use of option oh, nice. from the flow until now. Big suplex grab, making sure you can't stay on shield uh, too happily. Okay, the net interrupting Ooh. the up tilt. Ooh. Up no jump! Well. Another one. No jump! Good way. Back keg on a Pokemon stage. Kid. Oh. Pushing with flow away and away. Can't find no, it. No, B. Go Not for the up air instead. Say. Kid playing it safe. And the flash chain back. Punch. That's an aerial smash attack right there. Oh, yeah. And that's some KO power. Kid with a very solid lead in game number two. One punch. Either way, gets the command grab right there. Where is the flow going to go? He's taking a lot of damage off these grabs. Taking a lot of damage off these suplexes. The jump, the Nair interrupting that. Such control, but Pauly Nair one-upping the me probably Nair just has a little bit more distro and a little bit more oh control there. God. The Nair comes out. Kid forced the air dodge, forced the upbeat early, and Ra flow evening. The stock count so solid, so methodical with that offstage pressure. All of the teleport cancel, man. Reflow is different. You, you were right, bro. His uh, teleport cancel has been uh, second to none yes. so far. Rapid Jab gonna push you off stage with Flow in a great position once more. Probably gonna throw out a couple of down tilts to make sure Kid can't feel safe. Command grab not hitting his mark this time. Again, the down B from me, Brawler, that feign jump. Such a huge part of his gameplay. The back airs are searched for. Kid, maybe a little bit too committal here. And Raflo is catching on. A nice call out by Kid, but relying on call outs this late into the game. It's a little bit sus. Let's see if Kid can find something with the center stage control. Raflo playing it slow. And Kid again cornering himself time and time again. Maybe a little bit too committal. One up air, one up B. And that's Curtin's Kid with attempt after attempt. And Finally, one sticks, and look at how far it goes. Where did he find that up there <laughs> to get that drop away? Not Narnia, bro. <laughs> Definitely a kind of sure I'll figure it out. I don't know how he found that one, but kid, uh, you know, found the dreams, man. I don't know how he finds it. It's that youth. Is it? <laughs> they both got that youth, were you? <laughs> no, but I get what you mean. Uh, the way kid is placing his pressure is essentially high risk, high reward. But it also means that sometimes out of nowhere, he just kills you, and that's exactly what we saw right there. The back hit of the Nair converting beautifully into the Thrupper. It is now 1-2-1. One, one. These two French prodigies are facing off for the set lead. Game three, back to Small Battlefield. Very pivotal game right now. Ram's going to see who can kind of take that lead going into game four at the moment, though. Uh, it seems like Reflo mm. definitely seems a little bit uncomfortable on how Kid's kind of playing neutral now. A lot of the time he's been going for a lot of Nair to kind of interrupt what Reflo wants to do until now. Has to deal with that early pilot attacks. Sybe from ledge. Raffles looking for something big, but playing it slow. And there you see the dash attack just committing to the option. And Kid said, it's not, it's not a bad option if I'm right. And right he is. There's the up tilt. No jump on the flow. It's not quite it, but the damage is racking. And the next hit could be deadly. Kid, he's looking for something mean. 
Yeah, something mean indeed, man. This oh, kid yeah. is a bully. Has to watch out where you want to go. Okay, gets the parry, runs around him, gets the grab. Nice. Uh, or just a jab instead. No up air conversion. Oh, oh. Thro uh, Thropper is looming. You saw Kid just sharking for something, just couldn't get it. The neutral be going to actually stall him. Good idea from Kid, but now, Whoa. though, down tilt back air. Great confirm from a flow, taking the early lead. The bully getting shoved into the locker. Raflo establishing some dominance here in game number three. Look at that, the LB2 ledge, just no two frame because it's the horizontal oh one. God. Nice grab, back throw, just rinse and repeat. Okay, a little bit of different of a normal getup timing on the Miz. Okay, the net falling out of it. Have to go back on the stage and getting shot by that oh up air. And again, Reflo still in advantage state. And the downer out of nowhere, Ramsey's Reflo just pushing on strong. Reflo looking. Unstoppable, the shorten on the up B2. Yes, you can shorten that move, it's crazy. And Raflo pulling out that mix-up just when he needs the up out of shield though. That's Frame one. three, that's a fast move. Kid playing some good defense. Oh yeah, chasing him down on the platform. He's been rolling away a bit too far, uh, a bit too much for Raflo's liking. He's understanding where he wants to be. Raflo with some great conversions, looks for the final hit. Doesn't overcommit though, I like how he's positioning. He's staying in control even when walling. But Kid says, hey, if you're a uh -oh. little bit too mild, if you're a little bit too lukewarm, I'll be there to wash you out. And that's exactly what he's been doing to the stock. 72 on Raflo. Raflo just barely getting away with his life. But look at that, the pressure continues. Up again, not quite gonna do it. But Raflo right now kissing the blast zone. <laughs> yeah, kissing it for sure. Has to watch out where he wants to be. I feel like Kid's doing a really good job of kind of commanding neutral at the moment understanding i might be on my last stock we can definitely do something to work like i said before me mm. roller can always come back as long as he's got those ladder confirms but at the moment though reflo just not giving it to him not giving it to him the up smash the weak hit and the upbeat to chase he just pulls the trigger oh, he yeah. just pulls the trigger and he has to in this situation That's side one. b big damage 23 a uh, Nair, up tilt, uh-oh! This is all it takes, Rams. I'm telling you, bro. As long as you're on the same stock, Mu Brawler is never losing. Another side Another beat. Side Super beat. armor's through, and a miss input, but no punish! Raflo starting what to crack drop. under pressure, kid. You don't want to give him a chance to shut the door tight, brother, kid. He's the comeback kid! He He's the, the comeback air. kid! And he misses, but the punish is not there, and Raflo whiffs, and kid whiffs! They're, they're scrambling now. The parry comes out, the panic sets in. Yeah, the nerves showing right now. Pokes him on stage with the forward air. Kid has to think about Get where he's going. Get him attack. Very aggressive option. You'll push him away. You make oh. one mistake and you might die. The flash Mac punch not doing his work. Wait. There's the drag down there off the stage. But Kid survives once more. But no, the explosive flame put in the end to that third game. It's 2 1 now for Raflo. Comeback Kid got stuffed out. Raflo defending the throne so far. That's royal blood, baby. Right now, the flow, he's looking solid. He's looking solid. Kid has to make a difference. Maybe it's a stage, maybe it's a play style, maybe it's just a mentality adaptation, but he cannot let it go on like this. That end, he had it in his clutches, but he fumbled a few <laughs> punishes. Fumbled is the right word, man. It was there, it was absolutely it was, there. It was absolutely there. Uh, but you know, it's, it's all about finding, for me, bro, it's all about finding these opportunities to kind of get your up airs, your up tilts in, yep. to get that thropper finisher. But what Reflo's uh, so good at is evading these options. Evading oh, yeah. the, uh, the idea, that, you know what, I don't want to be in that position where I might just die in a, in a second. Right. Uh, so. And, and, and so when Kid gets it, he's not ready for it. Sure. Because he's used to Reflo evading it beautifully time and time again. And so in that last hit situation, when you expect Reflo to be solid, and he crumbles a little bit, it doesn't matter when you're not ready for it, right? And so, kid, maybe not really sniffing the blood in the water there, mm -hmm. and a little, like one step behind Raflo right there. Uh, let's see if it matters. He's now, uh, well, on his final game here in Winners, it's two to one, Raflo favor. Let's get into game number four. We're switching up the stage. We're going to PS Double. Still two uh, platforms to work with. Bypass stage is always going to work, especially in New Brawler's favor, but Raflo, not giving a damn about no stage pick right now. Still taking this lead. No command grab. Wants to kind of mm. snatch him away on that platform, but the kid just can't get it started. Nice parry. Immediate suplex right there. Goes for the continued pressure. Uh -oh. And that Nair been dominating the air so beautifully for Kid. The chase down here. The up tilt. That's curtains, right? It is the platform. Kid is in control in game four. Pulling the trigger just like that when he needs to. You talked about Refle uh, Reflo, should I say, always evo uh, evading it. Uh, oh, but yeah. still couldn't evade right, right there. Kid was ready that time and, and did so accordingly. Kid now in the driver's seat, but Raflo, look at him, he's racking damage, 93 already. Kid bleeding, not really getting any solid hits in the second stock. Raflo is dominating so far, that's a nice opening, but will it be enough? 
Okay, teleport cancels away. Doesn't want to be anywhere near him. Gets the grab. Empty a lands. lovely grab. Yeah, good empty lap grab. Oh, and that big down there. And the up air too. Not a strong hit. But still lingering for a long while. Still to get that damage. And the delay on the back air. He was fast falling time and time again. And then for that final one, with the slow fall, mixes up the parry. And Kid, he has he has the composure to go for parries. But that's also a weakness, right? It's sure. pretty committal. The flow making good use of that. Great awareness from both players right there to play the mix up. Now we're back to essentially even. Kid with a strong lead now. It has evaporated. And the flow back in control. Okay. The back air showing as well. Gonna push on stage once more. Goes for the down beats, kind of mix up the recovery. Actually going low. Wants the command grab back again, committing a bit too hard. Showing that C once more around just with the back air. And the side B somehow kid evading everything that Raflo is pushing out. Oh, Wants the pivot oh, grab, but no. Uh, kid is wait, right there. Wait. Maybe a ladder confirm. Can't find the thopper and again Raflo moving on. Again, not finding it. The platform not in the right position for him to fall with the up air. Now kid dropping two huge openings. Uh, that's got a sting. The flow not getting hit by the Mac Punch again, oh the patience and the drag down and the back throw. So just nice. one, two, three, and just like that, the flow solidifying the control that he has achieved in the latter half of this game. This man's nuts, but okay, big dash attack gonna linger just a little bit longer, gonna push him mm -hmm. away, but the flow doing a good job. Commanding stage control says, you know what? I will command the game. It's all up on you to kind of disrupt me. Kid getting tagged by the rapid jab, nothing big. The tech chase not quite gonna be much. Empty land grab, just so cool, so calm, so collected, so concise, and there's Ooh. the back air. I like that. I like that. that that's hurt. how that's how you deal with that pressure, Absolutely. right? You gotta make a call out happen because if you play too solidly, you're just gonna bleed out. Oh, again, these empty up grabs are keeping Kid guessing, but he doesn't know what to do. Definitely hasn't done the homework right now. Reflow, definitely the teacher in session. Kid has to work on him. How can he actually clean the stop? Mm -hmm. How can he bring it back to even? Uh, around? There's no options right now. Reflow showing to him. And Kid has to start moving around more. No more shielding. Four is Raflo to dash attack. We haven't seen many dash attacks from Raflo whatsoever. Mm -hmm. This is big. The platform could be an assist. All right, now the juggle again, the up away, like you mentioned before, Fabs. He, that wants nothing to do with that. The flow, very smart, just plays it for the lowest common denominator. Oh. That pickup, it failed, just barely the down throw, the panic, the air dodge, the follow up. The flow is all over, kid, and finishes the job with a solid back air. And the flow, after a little bit of touch and go, picks it back up and brings it across the finish line. What a solid victory right there. What momentum that's gonna carry him straight into winner's finals where he fights the Mexican representative between Leo and Spargo. Such an aggressive option from Kid. He was kind of understanding where to 